Welcome back to the Champ de Mar Arena for day three. It's the Paris 2024 Highlight Show. I'm your host, Eric Olanowski. Today, we'll talk about one of the greatest Olympic upsets of all times that took place yesterday. We'll also take a look at not one, not two, but three reigning world champions who dropped out of gold medal contention before reaching the finals. And we'll wrap up the show by laying out the gold medal matches at Greco-Roman 77, 97, and women's wrestling 50 kilos. Let's start with Vinesh Pogat from India, who scripted one of the most shocking wins in Olympic history in the opening round at 50 kilos, taking out the top pound for pound wrestler in the world, Yui Sasaki from Japan. Susaki, the four-time world champion and reigning Olympic gold medalist, had never lost an international bout until yesterday when Vanessa shocked the world, getting Susaki off balance before bulldozing her over for the match deciding takedown just as time expired. And just as we touched on yesterday, Iran has officially accepted its spot at 57 kilos, replacing the injured reigning world champion Stefan Micic from Serbia, who dropped out due to a knee injury. On paper, reigning world gold medalist Akshu Makhmanov of Kyrgyzstan, Gabriel Rosio Kindalan of Cuba, and Yui Sasaki of Japan were tabbed as favorites to win gold in their respective weight classes, but bracket busters had different plans here in Paris. Let's move to the finals at 77 kilos, 97 kilos, and 50 kilos. We'll start at Greco-Roman 77, where Demeu Zadraev of Kazakhstan will meet now Kusaka of Japan. Demeu Zadraev had himself a day on Tuesday, beating two-time world champion Aksu Makhmudov of Kyrgyzstan and two-time world silver medalist Sanan Sulimanov of Azerbaijan. He'll now meet Japan's reigning Asian champion, now Kusaka, for gold. This will be the first time these two have met in their careers. We'll move to 97 kilos, where Arthur Alexanian from Armenia will meet Mohamed Hadi Saravi from Iran. Arthur Alexanian, the white bear, is shooting for a second Olympic gold medal in fourth overall. He'll meet rival Mohamed Hadi Saravi. This will be the fourth meeting between these two superstars with Alex Anyan owning wins at the 2019 World Championships, 2020 Tokyo Olympic Games, and 2022 World Championships, giving him the three nil match advantage over Saravi. Alex Anyan won bronze in London, gold in Rio, silver in Tokyo. What will it be in Paris? Before we move to our next weight class, we went to Tehran to talk to Sara V about the potential matchup with Alex Anyan and the hunt for Olympic gold. Here's what he said. فشار که ما دارم نیستم که معمولا بر مسابقه که میلمون فشار رو خودم احساس کنم. ولی تمرینایی که کرده بودیم و اردوایی که پشت سر گذاشته بودیم، خودم امید دارم که توی سکوی المپیک وایستم. از من همین طور باعث افتخار بوده برام. تونستم تو مسابقات المپیک که میدون بزرگی همه ورزشکارای دنیا آرزو دارن تو المپیک کسب نشان کنن منم تونستم یه مدال برنز بگیرم ان که بتونم تو المپیک پیش رو هم رنگش رو بهتر کنم هم دل همه هموطنامو شاد کنم آرتور کشتیگیر بزرگ و با تجربه از الان سالیان ساله که تو این بحث داره کشتی میگیره و مدال کسب میکنه و من چند باری باهاش کشتی گرفتم و امسالم به احتمال زیاد فینال المپیک رو با آرتور میگیرم و مطمئنا با یه شرایط بهتری باش کشتی میگیرم و کشتی قشنگی رو همه مردم میبینن And at 50 kilos, the finalists will be Sarah Hildebrandt and Jusnes Guzman Lopez. In some of the most unfortunate news of the competition, Vanessa Pogat of India has missed weight at the Olympic Games. And without getting into too much detail, Article 11 in the United World Wrestling Rules state that if a wrestler misses weight on day two, the loser from the semifinals, Jusnelis Guzman Lopez from Cuba, will bump up to the gold medal bout. Vanessa has now been disqualified from the Olympics and will move to last place in the 50 kilo bracket. Bracket. That'll do it for the Day 3 Paris 2024 Highlight Show. I've been Eric Lewinowski. Until 1700, I say so long, wrestling fans. Mm -hmm.